Your skin is looking great, popping. That's the filter. That's the filter. <laughs> you got some of filter today. I got blue eyes right now. You got blue eyes? <laughs> I ain't even peep that. I didn't even peep that. Well, you look great. I'm loving the glasses, the hat, all that. Thank you know you, what baby. I you know what I love about you? That yo, you could dress down and dress up and still be like looking great no matter Thank what. Thank you. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Cause that now since we in quarantine and Everybody be looking great. <laughs> Mask on, everything on, like, girl. Yes, yes, trust me. I had to get my, I had to pull it together because I'd be looking like a man the mother days that I would be doing these stop interviews. Stop, man, stop. <laughs> Not a man. Yes, the struggle is real. But, so we saw that you had a big announcement for us yesterday. We just want to jump right into it. Yes, I let's was, jump into it. When I saw that you um been announcing it, that you had an announcement for like a week now, I was like, wait. Pretty V I breed. What's the announcement? Yeah, she didn't put the line. Girl. Let me tell you, I was people kept saying every time I say I got an announcement, that's what they they first say. Like, Pretty V is having a kid. And I'm like, right, I'm gonna let y'all guess that because look, people will be on my page trying to figure it out. That's some more exposure. Like, all right, I'm a poor right. kid. But no, it was City Trends. It was my products that's already in stores that I'm going to have online. So I have my five-piece makeup brushes here that will be online. Nice. I have my ten-piece makeup brushes that's going to be online. Nice. I have my power brush cleansing kit. Nice. That's why the skin is popping, too. Oh, my God. Your no, own products. I could, like, I could take the filter off, like, for real, for real, my skin is not bad. I just, you know, I just like the vibe of the filthy filth. But, you know, God is amazing. I started off, I'm still with City Trends. We still work. Again, that's, that's, I love, love City Trends. I love what they have done with my brand. Um, They allowed me to expand my brand. It allowed me to be a bit, I felt, I feel like a businesswoman. You know, I feel like I'm on IG still, of course, because I got a, I have, a, I have an audience, I have supporters that need me on there, and in these times as well, because you know we suffer from depression and anxiety. But when, but when, but when you go into the store, you'll see my face on every box in City Trends. They allowed me to do that. I started with them just promoting clothes and going and, and promoting events for them. Now it's like, girl, you have your own merchandise in the store. That's a blessing in itself. And then for, for allowing me then on top of that to get it online this yeah. Friday, that's big. Because they don't have they don't have somebody else doing that in their store. City Trends don't yeah. even have it online. So they allowed they allow me to be a part to have that, you know? Okay, okay. So that's how you link the two. So you have the storefront and, and then, then we you have, have the online. online. Yeah. It's totally com. it's totally separate. But it's still the products that you see in stores, and it's going to be on the site as well. Very, very nice. So one word to describe how you feel it besides excited. Oh, my God, nervous. Nervous? Why? I'm excited but nervous because, again, you know, I thank God for Tennessee because Tennessee, in, in, in the stores and city trends, I was sold out in 30 minutes. I want to be sold out in 10 on Friday, you know? So again, it's just the humble, the humblest in me, like, just, to, just you know, like my friends, is like Venus is gonna be sold out on Friday. And I'm just like, you know, I want, I, I know, I know it will be, but it just, you know, just trying to- It's still nerve wrecking. It's still nerve wrecking. It's still even nerve wrecking in the stores too, you know, yeah. like making sure it sells out. Cause I, you know, it's, it's income from all areas. And I want to make sure like they're good and I'm good. Right, I'm always right, worried right. about if anybody else is okay, and then it's me. But mm -hmm. this is the this is a company, it's the business. So I want to make sure, like, we're still selling in the stores. Mm -hmm. You know, a, a lot of city trends are not opening, are not open right now. But when, if, when they are, and, and, and the ones that are open, to still allow me to, you know, sell, 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 and then the online on Friday, sell out. 
Right, and right, was, right. Well, I'm, I'm putting I'm all excited, the though. I'm excited. good vibes out there for you. You should be very excited. So what inspired the beauty line? What inspired all of this? Because you started doing videos in your robe in the kitchen. So how do we get from doing videos in a robe to now you doing this, this amazing stuff? Um, again, my comedy would never go anywhere. I think everybody as an entrepreneur, as a businesswoman, even as a comedian, whatever it is that you do, should always have different hustles and different things. You also, you should also want to extend, expand your name in the business. And I feel like when I first started hooking up with City Trends, I already knew in my dream, and I might sleep, and I might pray at end, that I knew I was going to be a part of a big company, and this is what God laid out to be. I'm still not done. You know, I still want different things. I still want to be easy breezy cover girl. But that time will come, you know. But it feels amazing, and it feels good, and then the comedy will forever be there. Again, that's my ultimate goal, to have my own sitcom show, to act, to be in movies with Taraji, to be I'm with the Hug up on Jim Carrey. Love up on Jim Carrey. Yeah. Everything. But right now, you know, we're going to do this comedy. That we, we know how to do this comedy. And until that time happens and I get that, that casting call. And I've been going on casting calls. We've been, I just had a table read with B. Simone. We got some big things coming up. But at the end of the day, like, we got to get, we got to chase that bag. We got we to gotta have other things to, 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 to do, too. Okay, okay, okay. I see you. So what's the one thing you would say you can attribute your, your success to? Like, if you could give anybody some advice right now, somebody that's starting on social media, that wants to pretty much do exactly what you're doing, what's the best piece of advice that you can give them? Oh, my God. In this quarantine, I've, I have um, trained myself to pray, write, and create. So I, I think the best thing for anybody that wants to come into this entertainment industry, again, like I said, I'm new to this. I'm not... I have my own my own line, which is the VXL collection where I sell bathrobes, t-shirts, hats, everything. So I have my own separate business that I do. Mm -hmm. And now the online made 15th on Friday. Now in store the city trends. So all that just collectively happened because of what God instilled in me and the, the talent, the comedy, being raw, being authentic, being organic. So all blessings will come pile up. You could be a comedian. But there's something out there that God said, you know what, I'm going to give you, I want you to be the face of Wendy's. I want you to be the face of McDonald's. So don't just put yourself in a box as being just one thing. Just know that God has a list of things that he has aligned for you, but you have to be ready for it. So, me think me, I go be on Instagram and this and while and out. But God said otherwise, God said, okay, I'm going to give you while and out. I'm going to give you your own merchandise, but I'm going to also give you in store. I'm going to give you an online I'm going to also have you doing McDonald's commercials. Everything that I knew as a child I wanted to do, God has given it to me. So what you have to do is you have to pray really steadfast in your word and believe what you're praying about. And just know that it's going to come to pass. So that's how I do it. So now I'm like an entertainer, businesswoman, comedian. Like this is too much things that I have on my belt. And I'm so grateful for it. That's awesome. And when you make a plan, God makes a plan. Yes. And now the music, booty squeeze is out right now on yes. the platform. Booty blood clot squeeze. <laughs> if you want to drive this girl now, boot, booty squeeze on the flank, sit down. Yes. Make them sit down, yes. Uh, we have the booty squeeze t shirt that, oh, this is the wrong one, that we are, that my team shipped out today. Okay. I know you guys are going to be so excited to get it. Booty squeeze. I'm going to need me one. Yes, sis. Club I got one. triple D's. You got a shirt that's going to fit my triple D's? What you need, a 2X or 3X? <laughs> I think, you know, I like it, you know, fitting kind of close. So extra large would be good. Okay, all right. Because, you know, the boot, the boots may be like 4X, but they go out for that. You know, look, mine, Girl. Is, mine is extra, 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 extra small. <laughs> when I look, that's what I look. If I have, if I get a boyfriend, honey, they're going to have to do me in the dark, girl, because they can see these cities. I'm like, ah! Not do you in the dark. <laughs> Every good. consistently in the dark. Because I'm the ass. I yes. But no, you funny. know, God is good. And I'm so happy that I expanded my brand. Because mm -hmm. again, people will put you in a box as influencers crazy. They'll say that. Uh oh, she frozen. It's buffering. Are we still there? <laughs> Are we still there? Are y'all still there? 
We buffering. Can y'all still see me? Can y'all see her? I locked out. I'm here. She she must have lost um because she's in the car probably. Let's get her back. Get her back. Back. Let's see. Sorry, y'all. <laughs> y'all know how it is. Where she at? Where she at? <laughs> Where she at? Where she at? Request me again. Y'all know how it is when you're doing um when you on live in the car. For those of you that are, you know, still here, you may not know who I am, but I am Shannon Mack. I have a show on YouTube called Petties and Mimosas. It's a celebrity interview while we drink mimosas and have pedicures. So I created the quarantine edition because, you know, we all on pause. So you guys are now tuned into quarantine and mimosas. So let's see if, if, if D is back. Let's see. Not yet. <laughs> We gonna get it back. We gonna get it back. We gonna get it back. She probably just lost service or something. Let's see. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Girl, you want? Did you sell Wi-Fi? <laughs> no, there's something said that my phone was hot and needed to cool down. Oh damn! Where you at? ATL. Yes. Okay. It's pretty hot down there. Yeah, it's so hot. Like, look at it. Oh, my God. Yes. Yes. It's super hot, so I had to come off of it. But okay. Yes, but back to you out. now. Okay. What were we just talking about? We were just booty talking about... Out. Booty Squeeze yes. is out right now on all major platforms. City, my my uh, my line um, will be at shopbootyv.com. Mm -hmm. All my beauty and electronics will be... Will be, um, will be online now, May 15th, which is a Friday. Nice, nice. I'm super proud of you. So what about your, your your family members back in Jamaica? Are they asking you to send them barrels? And you already like in the bar with them. They can't send me some little birds here. It's Miss Stewart. Girl, we asked that girl. No, I can't do that. They yes, must but, be. But all my family is in Miami and in Jamaica, too. I'm my family from Kingston, my grandmother's house is in St. Mary. Girl. Yeah, I yeah. They are, but everybody in my family is so supportive. That's They're good. So they're so happy. Girl, I didn't know you were Jamaican. You have to link after this, Miss Shannon, girl. Your Z, yes, my girl. girl. Yes. So my grandmother's from St. Mary, too. Okay, yes. Yeah. What's your last name? We'll, we'll talk about that off, um, off record. Off okay, yeah. <laughs> you, might, you know, you said the last thing, you might be kin to somebody, girl. Exactly. You lead, lead them. Right, exactly, exactly. Yeah, so. Mm -hmm. So, what is your ultimate goal? You, I know you talked about, you know, not being placed in a box and, you know, having multiple streams of income. But what, what is your ultimate goal? Acting. Yeah. Okay. Acting, is ultimate, acting is my ultimate goal. Even commercials, commercialized like this, basically being like print, doing print work. You know. Um, but ultimate goal is acting. TV's my passion. Movies are my passion. Just, just being animated. You know, I, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna be a blessing even on TV. Eat much more. Like I want people to turn on HBO, and they know that Pretty V is gonna be on that today. Like how we know Wilder, how we know Wilder now kicks off. I want the different shows of me a part of it. Um, yeah, it's coming. It's good. Yeah. I totally see it. I totally see yeah. it. So I got a um cute a couple cute questions. Uh, fill in the okay. blank. People might see you on top right now, but they don't know. Blank. Fill in the blank. People might see you on top right now, but what they don't know is their hard work. It's hard work, dedication. It's anxiety. It's depression. It's overthinking. You have to pray, you have to read your word. So God, so God can place the peace in your mind. Right. For real? For real. No, that's, no, seriously, that shit is real. Yeah. For real. I, I completely, completely understand that. When I'm not in the mood, I turn to blank. When I'm, when I'm, I actually wrote that down wrong. What I meant to say was, when I'm in a bad mood, I turn to. When I'm in a bad mood, I turn to my mother and God. Nice. 
When I feel like laughing, I watch Jim Carrey. That's your favorite um comedian, right? <laughs> Have you ever met him? Girl, no. I I literally when I had my table read the other day, like somebody brought up Jim Carrey because that's their favorite comedian as well. Mm. And I literally cried. And I was like, Aww. we're about to tear up. And I was like, I can't wait to meet him. <laughs> it's coming. Like, like Ellen DeGeneres, if you're on this live, Ellen, <laughs> meet Jim Carrey. I need to come on your show and I need to meet Jim Carrey. Yeah, Ellen, you need to surprise me with Jim Carrey and then surprise her with a check. How about that? Girl, because Ellen gives it out, honey. Yes, she do. And she don't got no problem either. <laughs> She love our little African-American tribe, honey. Come on. Facts. You sure do. The biggest sacrifice I've ever made for my dream is? I'm moving. 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 Oh, oh yeah. That is a, definitely a huge sacrifice. Like, I'm from Miami, mm -hmm. Charlotte. Like, from Miami, Raleigh was my stop, then Charlotte, then Atlanta. You never made a stop to New York? I'm always in New York. Never made a stop. Okay, okay, okay. L.A.? I was, I was never made a stop in L.A. People wow. Think, people think I'm living in L.A. They think I live in the... I don't even tell people I live in because it's in between. I'm always in Miami. I'm always in ATL. Okay. So you just got to find me. You have to promise me that if you're in New York or L.A. and I'm shooting Petties and Mimosas, that you're going to actually come on the show show so we can get... Because that's what my show really is. It's a show on YouTube called Petties and Mimosas. We get pedicures and drink mimosas and just have a conversation. Are you and, I'm, I'm in the building. What are we yeah. about? I'm in the building. I want a mimosa. What are we talking about? I'm going to get my crusty feet done, and we're going to talk about it. Yes. That's what right my PR told on everything. My PR told me, she said, yo, she got this show, and I'm like, are we getting petty girls? Like, what are we doing? Like, So, no, we are lit. Yeah, yes. I would love to be yes. a part of that. Yes, and I created the show on my own. with little, Driving Uber, $100 in my pocket, so I can relate to every single thing that you're saying. Every single oh, thing that wow. you say. And I yeah. definitely have a message for you at the end. Let's go. All right. All right. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. Okay. The last song that you listened to was? You said the what? The last song that you listened to was? Booty Squeeze. <laughs> on all major platforms. Let's go. All right. iPhone or Android? I'm busy. iPhone. Okay. Okay. Wilding Out or Girls Cruise? Stop doing that. Why would you do that? <laughs> I see them knuckle, I see them knuckleheads every day. I gotta go with girls group. You don't see Kim. Kim is okay. Like, you don't All right. see Kim. Lady saw our spice. Get away, I said, girls, don't do that. <laughs> oh God, the phone down. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna let you rock on that. See, okay. <laughs> see. Girl, you said lady saw our spice. Right. I love Lady Saw Down, but Spice is a sis all day. Spice yeah, so, is legendary. Not Spice, but Lady Saw is a legendary. You have to fuck with, you have to fuck with Lady Saw. But at the, right now, what's popping right now, and I've, and I've met her, and I think she's complete, like, Spice supports me. For, and I know if I met Saw, she would, you know, what up, girl? But right now, I love Spice. Spice is on fire. I like everything about Spice. I love and adore. So I have to go okay. with Spice. Okay, so basically, this is supposed to be a game. It's usually a game on my show called Petty or Mimosa. So I would give you two things, and then you would, if you don't want to answer, like if you didn't want to answer Lady Soul or Spice, you would take a chug of whatever we were drinking. But you sit in the car, so. Right. So look, <laughs> my little chug your water. All right, chug your water. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> okay, um, Little Kim or Rihanna? Oh my God, and I love them both. <laughs> Oh my god. Chug. You wanna chug? You wanna chug that H2O? Chug. No, let me chug. chug. I'm gonna be real. I'm gonna be real. I'm gonna be real. I'm gonna be real. Um Rihanna is super dope. Me and Rihanna have spoke several times through my DMs and she's so supportive of my work. Mm -hmm. Um Kim is like the big sister, you feel me? Like that's the big sister. Like, of course. All day, every day. I don't wanna take both of them. Okay, all right. I'm gonna let you have it. <laughs> yeah, let me have it. Let me let, I'm gonna me let have you have it. it. <laughs> Instagram or Facebook? Girl, Instagram. All day, right? Fast. Right. Dance hall queen or shatters? Dance hall queen. Sorry, girl. <laughs> That's where you gain a lot of influence from, you know, yes! to do the video. Oh, right? that. Girl, everything. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Radio or TV? 
Radio was my first passion. I'm gonna go TV. Mine too, mine too. You have a background in radio. Yes. Yes, so do I. Chili or Maya? Girl, I love chili. I talk to Maya every other day though. Okay. I'm gonna go, go with Maya. All right. Mom, Music I'm on live. I'm on live, mom. <laughs> hey, mom. You all right? I'm going there. All right, bye. Sorry. Um, music or comedy? Comedy. Lil Duval or DC Young Fly? Don't do that. <laughs> These are good. You can't front. Let me start a little bit because those are two guys that I adore and love. You know I did, girl. I had to come right for you. Oh my God! Look on who the celebrity. Who can we ask the girl? Who celebrity on the check in? Hey, yeah, she's in the check in, girl. She said, "Feel smooth and nice." You don't know your Yes. <laughs> um, I'm gonna go with. Can I take both of them with me? All right, I'm gonna give it to you. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna let you have both of them. But the next ones, mm -mm. you're not off the hook. Okay. Okay. Righty or lefty? Righty. Okay. Dance hall or hip hop? Wow, really? Really. I'm gonna go to the dance hall. Okay. Booty squeeze or yo, what up? Oh my God, I love it. <laughs> I gotta go and go with it up. That's the first thing. Yeah. We was jamming to that before you came in. All right. Yes. Chico Bean or Carlos Miller? Carlos Miller. Sorry, Chico. And last but not least, Henny or Ciroc? Ciroc all day. Diddy, what up? <laughs> I feel you. All right. So tell us again where we can find the merch. Tell us what you got going on so everybody know where to go, all that good stuff. Well, you already know the vibes. Um, this Friday, May 16th, my beauty and electronics will be officially on shop, shopcurtv.com. And it's also in the stores, City Trends. If the City Trends there, you go pick the product up. But also, I want you guys to shop online. So let's get the online buzzing. So this Friday, May 16th, you can shop for everything. Everything, everything that you've seen on my page thus far, you can shop for at shopreadme.com. Um, go check it out. Go register. Go do everything that you can do. Um, it's really dope. The website is so fun. And also, um, Booty Squeeze is out on all major platforms. Go Booty Squeeze. Send me your, um, your, your challenges as well I'm going to post that as well. Also, keep watching your TV screens because we got some big, 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 big news coming up again. Nice. Very, very nice. What do you think, before I let you go, I'm going to ask like, a couple more questions. What do you think is the hardest part about all of this? All of what you do? Keeping it up. Keeping keep, it up. Like, keep, keep keeping up and, keep, and, 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 and going. Hold on. You see, the best one from Brooklyn is calling me, too. So, y'all, <laughs> I'm on live, son. Hey, like, why y'all y'all calling? Like, what up? I'm lying. So you on live. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Wesley, right, call you back. <laughs> so, yeah. so you know um i think the best part about this is keeping it up keeping it up keeping it up and, and being consistent you know because again we want to vibe out and then you're like yo i got a deadline you know right i'm thinking i could drop the announcement i'm i'm think I could drop, I'm thinking I could drop the announcement and then be good. But right. yo, how the hell you gonna drop one video about it? They have no clue. You got almost 4 million followers. They need to know what you're promoting. So we right. need to have a countdown till Friday, you know? Right. So that's why I'm consistent dropping things. Like today, I, I just dropped the picture. I hope you guys go and like it, love it, comment. And then also, I got a video right after that. So nice nice yeah. nice you are just doing it up super big love 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 it Thank so you. what do you think is the biggest misconception about pretty v nobody ain't never asked you that one before huh? Girl, pretty v. I huh? do that. ricky right. a little bit right <laughs> um i'm gonna go with that people may just think that you know People don't even know, like, when they get around me, they think that, you know, stuck up because the name, the mm -hmm. name to VN or in this way, I pretty be fine. But mm -hmm. when they get around me, girl, you cool they shit. like, she the shit. This girl is so down to earth. I love her. She yeah. got the acne showing. She <laughs> got whatever showing. The edges is crusty. You know, the head tired, girl. Like, that's, that's my name. I'm pretty deep inside and out. So at the end of the day, like, 
when y'all come around me, it's nothing but love. I I was on the phone today with my homegirl. And I told her I love her like four or five times. You know, because that's I'm loving and I'm caring and you know, again, I mess up. I'm human. I'm not perfect. I'm not stuck up. And people just think that you know, Pretty V is just another light skinned chick that don't know nothing. But Pretty V right. also got a four year degree. Pretty I know that's also, right. I graduated on time. You know, so at the end of the day, like it's a lot to me that you guys should know. You know. I know that's right. And then, what is the biggest misconception about Vina? Hmm. Girl, you need to stop with these little, these little thinking questions. Uh, or do they are or are they one in the same? They're one in the same. Because Vina was always the girl to be involved in everything. So Vina was always getting that type of attention. Growing up, like, she had to go do this. First of all, Vina go get pregnant at 16. She too fast. She do this. She too that. But then I kind of switched it up on him. Mm -hmm. He did a whole other 360. So, but I think now it's, like, more so, like, Vina was involved in everything. Vina was this, Vina did that. But, you know, my real name is Devana. Devana. My real name is Devana. My mom put it a, a, a instead of an I. So everybody in my family called me Devina. My, okay. I, I, only, I, only, I only use... Devana, you know, if I got a file of taxes. And, you know, my homegirls in Miami call me my 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 homegirls in Miami call me Devana. They be like Devana. And I love it though. You know, it's yeah. Devana Eric Excel, you know, so you know yeah. that's why I go by Vina E. That's why I go by Pretty V. Mm -hmm. You know, like my best friend just said, she's in here, she said Pretty V is fun, but Vina is serious. Yeah, I did so, see that. I did see that. Vina yeah, so that's basically it's kinda she kinda summed it up. It's pretty V is fun. You get this character, you get this character. But if you're gonna talk to me one on one, you may get the spiritual V. You may get the one that's gonna pray for you automatically. You're gonna get the one that is going to to make sure you're good, love on you, hug up on you. And you know, Devana, you're gonna get the girl from Miami. And just like it is what it is. I hear you. I hear you. Yeah. Love it, love it, love it. So one last question, because I'm pretty sure everybody want to know this. So relationships, any in, anything in a far way that we can, you know, <laughs> expect, right? <laughs> anything? Or are you quarantined with a bay or like, what's that looking like? Well. Or no comment. You want to chug your water? <laughs> no, right. Um, if you might ask. Um, no, been single. Yeah, I've been, I've been single. I've been focusing on me. If my best friend is in here, she'll still tell you, like, she's been trying to get me to date for the last 45 days. And so when this shit started, she's like, you need a bae. And I was like, nah, that makes me a crib to lay in. That's what it is. They ain't gonna lay in my crib. I hear you, I hear you. But if the right guy comes along, are you gonna, like, tell him that you're working on your career, or are you gonna embrace it? I'm going to embrace it. That's what's up. That's what's I'm up. I'm going to embrace it because I'm a, I'm a fun person. I'm tired of hugging up all my girlfriends. They are tired yeah. of hugging up They're like, yo, girl, go, they like, go sit down. No more loving, girl. Go find out what you want to Go do a skit or something, V. Get off me. So, so especially when I'm always, I'm always in Brooklyn when I'm in New York. So, I'm always at my best friend's crib and she tired of me. Nice. I hear you. I, so, I yeah. completely get it. I so, it. You, so, so it, one day, one day, one day, one day, right, the right. one day, the pregnancy rumors will be true. You know, okay. One, one day. We're going to be looking out like, <gasps> we, right. we, we waiting, we waiting. So we got to toast right to now, something. Right. But right now, no man. No man. Oh, like, I got a peanut. Peanut been all right. <laughs> <laughs> I feel you. I feel so you. So what I want to tell to you, baby, because I love your energy. And I definitely want to connect with you after this call. Like you're super, super, super dope. I, I love this. This vibe, this 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 vibe about yourself, Thank and again, you. I, you have a story clearly, and you know, at the end of the day, like I think you're on fire. I think your your energy is amazing. It's magnetic, and Thank you just you. keep going with whatever you have going on with. You know, if I could be help to anything, please reach out. I after the DM, all that we could DM each other. But I love to connect with people because you would never know it's so many people that and, and that I inspire and that inspire me. You know, so. Again, like you keep doing your thing. I hope that your show gets on more and more and more bigger platforms and that God will continue to align you with everything. When Pretty V speaks life into you. Thank you so much. No, no, no. Thank you for having me.
Any, yes. let me tell you, anything. I don't, I don't shy away from from big or small opportunities. Small opportunities. That's what got me where I'm at. Let's be yeah. very clear. So why should I dumb? Why should I high up myself to something that I know something small can help me? You know, so and something that can help me. I'm never saying that your business is small. I'm just saying at the end of the day, I didn't know anything about you until now. You right. know, so why I would I, why would I not get on your live and speak? You know, because your platform will help me and probably they're probably registering right now while I'm talking about um, um, my product on Friday. So That's why would I not take the time to speak to you? Because you may be the one that we got a call to get me on the the the, the, the stage on BET. Never, never, never shy away from these from 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 people that that may not have the bigger following. Say it for the people in the back. <laughs> no, seriously. Like you know how many times it has to happen. You know how many times yep. people walk past niggas and they the they the main niggas we need to get in touch with. <laughs> and it ain't the ones that the numbers. It ain't it ain't the ones that's in the crib and the phones that we like. Oh, we gonna call the CEOs revolt. No, the 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 girl that we just walked past is actually the. The one we need to get in touch with because the CEO revolts Diddy and he's in LA. We need to talk to the one that he told to come down and take us where we need to go. So I never, I'm never gonna shy away from from people like you that's on the grind and I'm on the grind yeah, too. And that you you don't have three million followers, but I bet you in a couple of months you'll get to 20k. And I'm like, that's yeah, growing. It happens like that every day. Lizzo, yeah. Lizzo was the Lizzo did not have those numbers. Lizzo got pew, I don't know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Ooh, Lizzo gone now. You can't even touch Lizzo. So I'm never going to shy away from people like yourself and people that are even in my same caliber. They may know the same people. I need to get to know. You are on the rise. You are doing your thing. Why not take the time out of my day to speak to you and your brand? And you know what's funny? I've been working in entertainment for a dumb long time since 2002, and my shit is wow. just just starting to like bubble, get out bubble. <laughs> <laughs> no, seriously. Just now, yep. Oh, but it's I started okay. in radio at Kiss 101.7. I did afternoons. I was on the same time Wendy Williams was on. But wow. uh, my shit just took a little bit longer. And and you're right. It's okay. It is absolutely and it's okay. Because you know what? God is getting ready for you to... God is aligning your blessings so you could be all right. God's getting that door ready for you so you could be good. So don't ever think just because, oh... God ain't working out. You want it on your time, but God saying He gonna give it to you on His time. And when He give it on your, when He give it on His time, be grateful and embrace that. Period. Because your time is gonna come. That Wendy situation, whatever you, whatever radio you was going through, whatever you did, this is like God said. Let me allow you to create your own path. So when I see your creation and I see you create what you need to do, I'm gonna bless you abundantly. So you just gotta step fast in His word. That's all. Mad love, Davina. <laughs> <laughs> That's what we do. That's what we do at the Pretty V. Mad but... love. I really felt that. That really resonated within my spirit. So I really thank you for that. Thank you, thank no. you, thank you. And I wish you all the best. And you know I'm a DM you girl. I already yeah, follow you. I've been me. following you. I've been following you from since Mad long ago. But no, yeah. I'm actually going messaging fast. Real, okay, real. yes. I love you so much. I go get booty squeeze right now. All major platforms. And also, May 15th, this Friday, you can shop for all my beauty and electronics at www.shopprettyv.com. I love you. Please DM me. I love you more. Bye, y'all. Put y'all. Yes. Done, Noah. <laughs> all right, girl. Later. Bye. Oh, my God. Thank you, Davina. 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 Thank you,